Behold, blueprints. But where do they come from? Meet John Herschel, born in England in 1792. John Herschel was a Renaissance man with interests in astronomy, mathematics, chemistry, and several other branches of science. John had his hands full. He named moons throughout our solar system, studied color blindness, and translated the Iliad. We can't blame him for being an overachiever. After all, his father discovered Uranus. With a bright career behind him, John could have been content to sit back on his laurels and reminisce about his glory days. Instead, he invented the blueprint. More specifically, he invented a process called cyanotype. Here's how it works. Mixing ammonium iron citrate and potassium ferrocyanide creates a photosensitive solution that can be applied to anything capable of absorbing the solution and allowed to dry in place. Exposing this coated surface to ultraviolet light with a negative image will create a positive image on the surface, and it will also create a permanent blue dye called Prussian blue. <laughs> this exposure is what gives blueprints their unique tint. For decades, before the invention of copiers, blueprints were the only way to make low-cost copies of drawings. They quickly became invaluable to architects, shipwrights, and engineers. The modern world was literally built with the help of John's stuff of genius.